Yeah, those are both designed, um, just, you know, different things we saw uh, throughout the weeks and, you know, what their defense did, um, just a good way to attack their defense. So. Have you run those particular plays earlier this season? No, no, not those, partic not those particular plays. So. What did they show you tonight that enabled you to have so much success against the run, I mean, on the run? Uh, you know, some of the plays that we had dialed up this week, uh, they ran a lot of man coverage, so, um, you know, we had some of the, the – the, the zone read and um, the fly sweep working. So with those guys in man coverage, you know, the corners are chasing and uh, kind of leaves that side of the field open. Brian, how important was it to get this win tonight? I mean, it was your first conference win for the team, and you're coming off of a two-game skid. What was the morale I mean, it was huge. I mean, I think, uh, you know, more than anything this week in practice, I mean, you know, guys were kind of on edge. I mean, coming off of two, you know, tough losses, uh, you know, we just wanted to get out there, uh, you know, give it our all and get this win this week. So, you know, we're happy to do that. The third touchdown by you, was that also the you guys were down there to drop back? What, what were you looking for on that? Yeah, you know, they didn't, uh, they didn't bring any pressure. I mean, they dropped eight. So, you know, it's kind of hard. We had a little play action uh, pass going there. So, you know, everyone dropped out in coverage. And, you know, I saw a lane to run, so I took advantage of it. So that was yeah, no, that was a pass first. So, how fun is it to run? I mean, it's pretty fun. I mean, um, you know, like I said, I mean, I want to, I want to be a passer first. But you know, when Coach Ludd he dials those plays up, um, you know, I'm gonna run them, and you know, I'm gonna run them to the best of my ability. So, uh, you know, it, it is fun though. Well, uh, at the beginning of the week, uh, our defensive backs coach, uh, Coach White, had told me, and uh, this whole week, just working hard, trying to get my alignments and assignments right, and uh, I was glad we could able, I was able to uh, execute today. Okay, now, earlier in the week, uh, Coach Rocky said he was going to kind of skip that with the defensive package, and Josh Wade said that he was going to get comfortable. Do you feel like that helps you out of secondary more comfortable with the pass today? Yeah, I felt like our game plan this week was really suitable to, like, the type of players we had in our uh, our backfield at defensive backs, and uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure it showed. What was, I guess, what was easier about that? Were you, did you guys not have to think about things as much and not have to read as much? It was, uh, we had a lot less um, different types of plays, so we could really focus on the plays that we did have and uh, our alignments assignments and uh, less audibles on defense, and uh, it was really good for us. Uh, it actually it builds a lot of confidence, especially coming off not playing very well the last two weeks and then coming out our defense and offense both stepping up at the same time and showing like, what we really look like when we play outside football. Yeah, it's kind of what you live for when you play college football, those times where you got to step up and make plays or in like the crucial fourth quarter moments, that's really what you live for. What does it mean to the defense to limit this team with two touchdowns? I mean, the last few teams that you've faced you know, they've racked up a lot of points from you guys. How, how big was that? Uh, it's a big confidence builder for sure, and we're glad as a defensive backs that we could uh, hold their passing yards down. And Hawaii has great athletes on the outsides and a slot, and we're glad we can contain them for the most part tonight.